Parks Victoria crews are on the prowl for timber thieves. Thousands of cubic metres of wood is being stolen, stripping the bush of centuries of growth. So it's not just individual households going out to get a load of firewood to keep their family warm. It, it genuinely is a commercial level of offending um, by organised groups for personal gain. Okay. Pretty much it's one metre. Andrew Dean and Chris Mercier have found yet another crime scene near Shepparton in northern Victoria. It's become a timber theft hotspot and they're concerned the damage will be irreversible and we're talking about a finite resource. It has significant impacts to public safety, wildlife habitat values, and just the, the biodiversity um, and sustainability of the parks themselves. The amount of um, habitat lost through uh, illegal firewood collection, it, it is accelerating like it never has. Offenders who get caught could face fines and even jail time. We're putting teams into the field all days of the week, all times of the day, um, across an extended period of time, because we know the best way to stamp out some of this offending is to intercept people in the field. Some of the timber ends up for sale on social media, while some is absorbed into supply chains that seem legitimate. And as temperatures drop, authorities are urging consumers to ask where their firewood was collected. They can't tell you then that should be a concern for you. If they aren't running a legitimate business, and by that, if they don't have an ABN, if they don't have a website or a business phone number, that should be a concern for you. And if a deal seems too good to be true, it probably is. Rosa Ritchie, ABC News, Shepparton.